Hey guys, Cobra here. Welcome back to another Raid Shadow Legends video. So, we've got the Hydra that has refreshed yesterday. And I wanted to, to show you guys what the Hydra gives to an endgame player such as me. Where we have a clan that beats both hard, uh, well, not both, but all of them hard, brutal, and nightmare. Um, it's a pretty cool, cool, good way to get a lot of resources. And let's have a look at the stone skin and protection sets that uh, I, I get as an end game player. So it's all going to be random. I'll be selling the ones that I don't need because I've been getting a ton lately and I really, really need to uh, to start limiting the ones that I'm, I'm using. So the five stars are not going to be used so often. So let's see. Uh, we get a five star attack percent, HP percent resistance. Um, stone skin, it's great, but I mean, even if it's like a triple resist, um, I, I would I would have loved uh, if it was a six star. I, I kind of need to sell it because I have many of these already. Stone skin is great when you have high resist, but you kind of need the speed as well. All right, as a substat, the attack percent is just going to be there, really. So let's sell this. I'm going to look at the uh, mythical one at the end. Protection one, speed, accuracy, crit rate. I like it because the six star legendary can roll let's say four times on the speed that's great even as a single item because you also get the one bonus of 20 resistance extra for a one piece given to a champion so let's say they're looking for those stats they get a nice boost to 20 resistance right there you don't need to go all the way to get all these benefits so even like three pieces um let's say you you want to replace your speed items instead of having a two two uh, speed set you've got three pieces you get a 12 percent bonus there it's actually solid not that bad uh, so I'll keep it and then we've got the, the stone skin with speed accuracy and attack percent well I'm gonna keep this one and roll it only if it rolls like a triple on one of these two although the five stars usually I straight up sell all right five five star uh, protection mythical on the attack percent um, well if, if this rolls like a, a quad on attack percent then it's great because it can be used on an attack um champion but it's it's not a six star so how how much can this attack go it's gonna go to maybe 25 percent if it rolls a quad because it's 20 percent on a quad right i think so um it's kind of gonna suck i i think so i'll keep it because it's a mythical so i basically kept these three 270 gold coins and then another mythical look at that uh hp percent on the glove attack flat hp flat defense flat this doesn't have any justification to hold it so i'll sell it this one's a rare hp flat stone skin um then we'll look at the stone skin with speed crit rate accuracy this is okay because there's some some teams that use speed accuracy and crit rate and it's a stone skin so the five bone the five star is is okay let's look at the mythical one speed that's good it's still five star though so it, it won't roll that high so 300 here, so 570 gold coins out of these two items. Let's look at the brutal rewards and uh, see how much I got out of this one. Boom, another mythical. Look at that. Look at the legendary ones for stone skin. I'm so happy about that. Resistance on stone skin, no speed on the substat, but I'll keep it for now. HP percent there. That's the only thing that's good. And and the defense, that's 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 okay. But you still need still need the um the speed so this one is it's a very typical protection uh item that you can get but it, it doesn't match what i'm looking for so no speed here um so I'll, I'll probably sell this one then let's have a look at the gloves defense percent attack percent hp percent flat flat um unfortunately we cannot re-roll items and uh, even if i would love to have this kind of stone skin it doesn't it doesn't really justify it I'm, and I'm running out of room on my account so I'm selling that let's look at the attack percent boots uh, if this one had crit rate I would have kept it but the crit damage only makes it very difficult to keep on an attack percent boots I'll keep it though in the off chance that it gets a quad roll on crit damage so I'll have to roll this item to to deem it worthy this one's a five star protection no speed no HP percent here um, crit damage no crit rate so very bad and then let's look at the legendary, the the, the mythical one, defense flat, uh, flat on the on the primary. We can only roll these, unfortunately. So I will not keep it in the hope that we get one in the future. Like, should I keep it in the hope that we get one in the future? We don't even have mythical reforged stone, so I guess I'll sell it and I might regret it in the future. So another three hundred and fifty. 
So that's almost 900 gold coins so far. I'm going to round it up to 900. Another mythical right now. They've, they've definitely seemed to increase the chance of uh, the mythical gear. Speed there on the stone skin. I like it. Plus resistance right there. And accuracy, that's a good one. And it's a legendary one. So this one's got a crit rate resistance in attack. Uh, even though it's a six star, it doesn't have a speed. But I'll keep it for now. Crit rate, crit damage, speed, resistance on protection, mythical, and it's on the crit rate. So this can roll high enough. Um, if it rolls on any of the four, it, it's it, I think it's going to be okay in terms of an item. Speed, accuracy, protection, attack, resistance. Uh, again, this doesn't look so good. The five stars are try to sell only if they're not mythical. And uh, the stone skin, it, it's, it's not a simple five star. It's better than usual five star gear. That you would get so crit rate resistance and hp percent this is good for protection but again i'm looking for more uh speed in terms of in terms of this set i, I need the speed substats to justify that set over the the stone skin so this one is a chest piece attack percent crit rate i almost sold it by the way and it's actually a good one because it, if you boost the crit rate on this one it can go like to over uh 20 and that's going to be very good on a damage dealer then finally, let's have a look at the Nightmare Chest. Uh, we're looking at a good amount of like for almost 1300 or so gold coins. And with this one, we should be closing into 2000 overall, right? Look at that mythical 450 there. So going over the 2000 mark, let's be let's be lucky here. So resistance, crit rate, defense. Um, although good, I don't see how I can use this one. I, I would say H. HP percent and speed would be nice in this one. So I'm going to sell it. Unfortunately, let's see. Uh, defense flat. Again, no reforge. Five star, no speed. Then we look at the flat defense boots. Ah, unfortunately, again, with the flat stats we, that we cannot change. Really, crit damage gloves. Uh, although stone skin, there's no substance that help the crit damage. So crit rate, speed um, would have been nice. Attack percent would have been nice here to, to use on, let's say, something like a Trunda. Uh, this one's good. Defense percent, no defense, no HP percent here, but we got resistance and accuracy, so I might keep it uh, for a reroll. And then we got a protection with the speed and defense and HP percent, so that's solid actually to roll up. And then finally, with the remaining one, again another mythical. Let's have a look at this one. HP percent, defense percent, um, solid, but no speed subs. That then attack, attack here. So. Probably gonna sell it because uh, this could have been good on a Nethril. I don't have a Nethril. Keep it. I'll keep it. Uh, speed. Good. Speed on the stone skin. HP flat chest uh, with no good stats on the others. Uh, resistance, HP percent accuracy, 5 star zone protection. So that has to go. And then crit damage, crit rate, HP percent though here. So this can be used on a, an HP nuker. So that's solid. And then crit damage, crit rate, attack flat, HP percent. That's good again on an HP nuker with the stone skin. Love it. Uh, well, crit rate, crit damage, HP, HP percent. Again, this is solid on a nuker type because this also gives 15% HP on the two set bonus. So you can use two pieces of this one plus a savage set to, to have uh, the protection going. So... Um, I think pretty solid pieces overall, but I have so many now that they're really starting to stack up and uh, Look at that. Look at just how many protection I have and Then how many stone skin they're really filling up my inventory, but I prefer those instead of you know um, Farming for other sets. We've got the, uh, the savage Event going on right now, but I'm probably not even gonna farm that one might do I'll think about it uh, but overall, look at the clown shop coins that I have now on the account. I've got 4,850. You might think it's a lot. It's actually not because uh, when this rolls out and this comes in, the um, the chaos ones, or when we get to level 17, these sets can be worthy. Crit damage and speed uh, as a bonus set. So uh, yeah, we're not that far off. Uh, maybe one or two CVCs away, and we should be able to get to level 17 with the clan. So this was the video, guys. Thanks a lot for watching. Subscribe if you haven't. I'll see you in the next one. See ya.